Well, the destroyed homes in Elkhorn is now upgraded to an EF4, but people are moving back after months of rebuilding. KTV News Watch Evans' Alex McClune has the story. April's outbreak still shows when you look above Elkhorn, but door to door, people see progress. Feels good. I like this walkthrough a lot. Jenny Parr was ready to sign here before the storm moved in, taking down her new house two weeks before she could move in. Round two. It's one of 13 homes crews took down to the foundation and retrust. Now ready to move in this September. It feels like it's coming together again and that there's hope. We're probably about two to three weeks out. Week by week, more people are moving back in after staying in apartments or with in-laws like Dylan Sutton. I can't praise Charleston enough to get uh, us back. Charleston Homes owns most of the properties and crews, still installing roofs, windows, and siding. We we're kind of just summer help. Scott grads like Blake and Brady are some of the workers laboring through the heat. How do you do it? Uh, cut offs. Yeah. <laughs> cut offs and plenty of water breaks. The college students say a summer spent clearing foundations might lead to a career in the industry, even after police mistook them for looters and two months of cleaning up. Toasters, yeah. ceiling fans, some fridges we found, scrapbooks, all that stuff. Kind of sad. Even stuff from that far neighborhood. Yeah. The National Weather Service now upgrading the tornado from an EF3 to an EF4 based on new wind speed readings and overhead images of the aftermath. And yet, no deaths here off 204th and 4th Streets. Look at these houses. You, how? You know? It's, it's amazing. Cars with workers still congest the streets, and Charleston CEO wants everyone back in their homes by April. From Sutton's garage, the view is getting better and better. The neighborhood is just coming back piece by piece, and we really like to see all the other uh, people that lost all their houses. We can't wait to be back as one neighborhood again. The best thing was when we saw the street lights start going up again. Returning home one by one. In Elkhorn, Alex McClune, KETV News Watch 7.